Hi, my name is Tenley Bredding and I'm a tax consultant with the Walters Kluwer CCH Training and Consulting Department. In this video, you're going to learn how to use the LIST tool in the ProSystem FX Tax software. There are several reasons you may want to incorporate the LIST tool into the preparation of your tax returns. Use the LIST tool to create a list of numeric amounts that you want totaled in a field. The LIST dialog box keeps a running total of your entries and then inserts that total into the selected field. Once you have created the list, a white paper statement will be generated and included in the accountant's copy. This list can be pro formatted over into the next year's tax return to help build an internal audit trail. Let's go ahead and create a list in the ProSystem FX tax software. It's really simple to create a list in the tax software. In fact, the easiest way to do it is just to go to any numerical input field and click on that little yellow list button in the top left hand corner. That's going to open up your list dialog box. The first thing we probably want to do is title or give a name to our list. And that's really what this caption is here. You can change the caption to anything you like. We're going to go ahead and call this one gross receipts so we can better identify our list in the accountant's copy of the tax return. Now within the list, you can enter a description along with the amount. You'll notice that we already have some descriptions on our list. In fact, this list was pro formatted over from the prior year. So while I've started entering current year amounts, it also has prior year data. In fact, the prior year description also came over and that's just going to help in your current year data entry. Get things in here a little bit faster. I'm going to go ahead and add a new item to our list. And I'm just going to hit tab on the keyboard to move over to the amount field. You can actually continue to tab and type until you've finished entering all of the data on your list. A running total is kept at the bottom of the list. Now if you need to keep your list in a specific order, notice that there are buttons down at the bottom to insert or delete a line within your list. Once the list is complete, hit OK and that total enters into the field for you. Now you can tell any field that has a list because it will have a little green rectangle up in the top left hand corner. Now let's go ahead and look at the accountant's copy of the tax return so we can see our lists. You'll find all of the lists created in the tax return underneath the lists and notes bookmarks. And that concludes our discussion on the list tool. My name is Tenley Bredding, CPA and tax consultant with Walters Kluwer CCH. Thanks for tuning in today. For more ProSystem FX training resources, please visit our training and consulting webpage.